this here represents the surface of life surface and we see surfaces you know surfaces and about 300 years ago scientists they started wondering what was this this wood and what was this metal and what was what was it really so they start looking into matter so this side is matter and this side is mind mind and matter and the scientists well they discovered molecules deeper they went and they discovered these atoms and like I say they thought that was the smallest particle for a long time all these things we learn about in school they went deeper and they find inside the atoms these little electrons and neutrons and protons and they went deeper and deeper and deeper smaller and smaller particles smaller and smaller particles they found four forces on a deeper level the four became three and on a deeper level the three became two and then about 30 years ago modern science quantum physics discovered the unified field the unity of all the particles and all the forces of matter of creation not only did they discover the unified field but they found that everything that is a thing emerges from this field of no thing unmanifest it is unmanifest it is no hyphen thing but all things come from it anything that is a thing has emerged from this field of unity it's oneness the scientists know this exists, but if they wanted to get there, they, you can't get there, it's unmanifest. You can't walk into this field. But any one of those scientists could practice a technique, transcendental meditation, which, remember, true happiness is not out there. You're given a mantra. A mantra, a very specific sound, vibration, thought. Very specific. It needs to be life supporting at all deeper levels. And that mantra that you're given gives the key that opens the door. The mantra turns the mind within. Turns the awareness within. And you naturally dive. Why is it natural? Because each deeper level of mind and each deeper level of intellect has more happiness. And the deeper levels of mind and deeper levels of intellect correspond to deeper levels of matter. At the borderline of intellect, you transcend. Transcend is the key word. It means to go beyond. You're going beyond field of relativity, duality, experiencing oneness. Pure, unbounded, infinite consciousness. This consciousness has qualities. Infinite creativity intelligence energy love power and bliss dynamic
always been there, never had a beginning. It is and it will be forever. Unbounded, infinite, eternal, immutable, immortal consciousness, fullness. Any human being can experience this easily and effortlessly with Transcendental Meditation. Transcendental Meditation is just a vehicle to get you here. When you experience this level, you enliven it and it grows in the individual. All positive, light of unity, all positive. You experience this level and you enliven it and this ball of consciousness that you thought was just gonna stay the same for the rest of your life starts expanding and these qualities expand.